Hello everyone, I'm Seth with Exotic Motorsports and this is our 2017 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sport with 50,319 miles. It's in great condition, looks really nice. The um, front bumper here has a little bit of discoloring kind of uh, almost staining in the in the plastic. It's not real um, super noticeable. It is kind of subtle, but when you get up on it, you can see it. Very nice aftermarket hood. I do believe these headlights are aftermarket as well. It does have 20 inch wheels on 35 inch tires fuel wheels they look great um, not really any rock chips across the front no rock chips it's in really really good shape the front driver's side fender looks excellent no issues there front driver's side wheel looks great these are BF Goodrich all terrains the KO2s Driver's side mirror, same uh, kind of staining as the front bumper has, the uh, discoloration that you can see in there. Front driver's side door looks great. Rear driver's side door looks excellent, no issues. And it does have amp research power folding steps. And those look awesome. Definitely a must have for a lifted vehicle. Makes your life a lot easier. Driver's side rear quarter panel looks good. Rear driver's side wheel, excellent shape. Moving along to the back. Do have a few marks on the glass here. That might be in the tent. Matching spare wheel. Does have aftermarket LED taillights. Back end of the Jeep looks great. Moving along to the passenger side, looking at the rear quarter panel here. Same kind of uh, discoloring on the plastics pretty much throughout the entire vehicle. The, uh, the fenders are all like that. And again, we do have a little bit of marking in the glass. I'm pretty sure that's in the tent, but I can't confirm 100%. Rear passenger wheel. Looks great. Rear passenger door. No flaws there. Front passenger door. Looks excellent as well. And the passenger side steps work as well. No issues. Steps are in great shape. Front passenger fender. Looks good. It does have some markings here on the top the passenger mirror has some very light scratching on the outside discoloration as well front passenger wheel does not have any issues the wheel looks great i'll go ahead and walk around the vehicle from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the vehicle here at exotic motorsports we do these comprehensive walk around videos to give our out-of-state buyers the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from us sight unseen if they choose to do so walking around a vehicle from a one foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day-to-day -day basis and helps separate the larger more obvious flaws from the smaller less significant ones helping to give you a better well-rounded perspective on the true condition of this vehicle the paint on the vehicle uh, looks really really good this chief blue looks awesome no scratches in it really no rock chips um, the vehicle itself is super clean as far as the discoloration on the plastics i do believe that could probably be treated and uh, buffed out i don't think that's really a huge issue and with the lift the wheels tires steps it's definitely an awesome vehicle we do have jeep all-weather floor mats 
And something rare for a Jeep, we have very nice leather interior with blue contrast stitching to match the exterior. Looks fantastic. You have power locks, power windows, tip start ignition, manual seats, four wheel drive of course, five speed auto. And it is turnkey, like I mentioned, tip start. So you just tip it over and it starts out pretty easy. Full warning lights, no issues. Now there's just a few miles off. I apologize, it does have 50,323 miles. The interior looks great. Dash looks awesome, no UV damage or wear. It does have the Alp Alpine premium audio system front passenger seat looks great the upholstery and the condition of the interior looks really good super clean cup holders everything on the inside of here looks really top-notch no wear on the steering wheel or any of the buttons everything looks great the auto down buttons work for the driver and passenger and there you can see the Alpine stereo which sounds excellent. It does have Bluetooth as well. It does support USB and three and a half millimeter auxiliary if you'd like to pair your media that way. Uh, here in the back, plenty of room, really nice leather seats, one piece all weather Jeep floor mat, cup holders in the back here, and your rear window switch is built into the back of the center console. Those windows move quick. I think that's not necessarily a super uh, in-demand thing to have, but for me, it's it's the little things like that that I can definitely appreciate. How fast the windows roll up. Uh, Jeeps don't have a traditional hood latch from the inside. You just manually unlatch the hood like that. And then here on the inside, there's another release. You just kick it over to the side and lift it up right there. We do have a naturally aspirated V6 that is all stock, unmodified. And surprisingly for this little uh, Dodge V6 that's in here, it handles the lift in the tires pretty well. It doesn't feel like it struggles. It's not fast by any means. Uh, you're not going to be going anywhere in a hurry. But it doesn't feel so sluggish that it's frustrating to drive. It's still... Um, moves at a decent speed it still gets up to speed at a reasonable rate it doesn't you know you, you don't have to rev it to the moon to get this thing to go anywhere so it's it's still um doing its job pretty well for the lift and the tires sounds healthy idles really healthy it shifts very deliberately very smoothly um it just feels really healthy uh, the jeep is outfitted really nicely it's a really good starting point for overlanding or doing any kind of off-road exploration. It's at a great starting point as far as modifications go for that. But it's also still really nice to drive around the city. Um, if you wanted to make this your daily driver, I couldn't see there being anything to make that an unpleasant experience. There are tons of people who daily drive Jeeps like this all the time with absolutely no issues and overall it is a very practical vehicle with all the storage room that it has and uh, just the capabilities that this jeep has so that is our 2017 jeep wrangler unlimited sport if you have any further questions please feel free to check this out on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com thank you for watching